you guys are awesome singers and movers. You know, that's how I stand in line at the theme parks. I'm always dancing and moving around the people around me. It drives them nuts. But you know what? I just think it passes the time better. Well, lines and coasters aren't the only thing we're going to talk about. The Incredible World Park is all about God's creation. In fact, we have a Bible verse that we're going to use all week, and it's about creation. Can you guess what chapter of the Bible that it's in? Yes, some of you are on the right track. Get it? On the right track? <laughs> so funny. Enough of that. Okay, I have a special person for you to meet. He is the main man at the Incredi World Park. He is the Incredi expert on the Bible at Frederica Baptist Church. And I want to introduce to you Pastor Mike. Pastor Mike, come and join Hi, me. Hi, Hello, Pastor Mike. It's so exciting to be here with him. Now, before you give us our theme verse, I have some questions for you. Okay. I know that you've just recently moved to St. Simon's Island. How long have you been here? 11 do months. Do you like it? I do. Like oh, it. do you like roller coasters? I don't. Do you like it when they go way up and way? No. What about those go roundy rides? Nah, do you like the, Do you like it when you get on <laughs> or do you like it when you get off the Getting ride? off. Is oh, my that's oh, you know, are you married? Yeah, I am married. What is her name? Her name's Amy. She pretty. She's beautiful. Oh, can I meet her? Is well, she here? she's not. No, she's not here today. But oh. let me tell you about my favorite subject, the Bible. Oh, I love the Bible. Did you know the Bible has everything that God wants us to know about Him oh, wow. and about salvation? Mm -hmm. And so it's very important that we know the Bible. And the verse today that we're going to talk about is Genesis one one. Uh, which is the first book in the Bible. And so anytime you read a letter, it's always that first verse or that first sentence is so important because that tells us the theme of the letter and what's going to be happening. And so in the very first verse in Genesis 1-1, uh, the Bible tells us that in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. And there's so much information there because it tells us who did the creating uh, when the creating was done, uh, and what he created, the heavens and the earth, everything. So it's a super important verse. I love that verse. And do you know why God would want to create all this? Well, the Bible tells us a little later on that God did it to show his glory, really to just show how good he is. He is good, Pastor Mike. Well, boys and girls, we need to learn this theme verse, and we have it up here on the screen for you. Can we say it together? Let's all say it. In, In the, the beginning, beginning God, God created, created the, the heavens, heavens and, and the earth. earth. And when we say our verse, we will always say where it's found. I call that the address. It's where the verse lives in the Bible. So our address is Genesis 1-1. So let's say it one more time. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Genesis 1-1. Well, thank you, Pastor Mike, for joining us today. I can't wait to see you back here every day and to tell us a little bit more about something in this verse. Thanks, Penelope. I'll see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. You know, boys and girls, on this earth, there are some amazing, incredible creatures that God created. I have a friend I want you to meet. His name is Buddy Davis, and he's going to be with us every day telling us about some incredible creatures. Let's listen and see what he has to say today. <laughs> 